Hello, hello. Today we have here this JBL sound gear. We want to disassemble that. So let me show you how this is done. So we start out by uh, looking at the back side here. You know, you have this horseshoe kind of shape. And so you're going to look here in the back area. And you first you're going to lift off here this fabric part. You lift that off of the bottom. That's uh, held in place with some uh, clips, like some hooks in the from the fabric part here. And you have to detach all those hooks all around. And then you can just lift it off. It takes a while to get all those hooks out. And let me show you a little bit more detail about how these uh, hooks look like you can see here you can tell here they are all over the place so here a little bit close up and then uh, two of those hooks are actually uh, glued in place you those uh, are not going to be able to be detached that easily those are those two hooks are like located towards the also towards the um, end here towards the back side here let me point this out here this hook it actually broke off on this side so I had a really hard time getting that off and then here this hook was also glued in place in that one I was able to detach here on the uh, on this part here you can see how it broke off up there but it's not a big deal there's so many hooks in there that will it will be able to be uh, assembled again without a problem so then here we're going to uh, look at the further parts here. You can see there's a lot of screws up here that hold this plastic piece here in place. And uh, there's this metal plate, also a lot of screws in there. And here the second side, the left side, also has a ton of screws. You can also see here the speakers and the, uh, the buttons. Alright, so... Uh, Let's take those pieces off. So uh, I'm going to not. I'm not going to bore you with uh, unscrewing this, showing you how I'm screwing this. This takes a while, right? And then as soon as this is done, so far I've only removed all the screws from the plastic pieces. Not here the ten pieces, uh, ten screws of this metal plate. The metal plate actually gives a lot of stability to the whole device here. And there's like ten screws that hold the metal plate in place and there's three different types of screws so uh, you want to make sure to remember which type of screw goes where all right so then let's, let's open up here this left side once you have all the screws removed this is really easy you just take it off and there is not a whole lot in here look at that there's just the other the board for the buttons here for the volume buttons and the play pause button and of course the the two speakers are here and then here's a little bit oh, let me show you this here you can see the little board for the USB and there's a whole bunch of wires going through and at the tip looks like there's like a microphone right there Okay, so this side really doesn't have a whole lot going on. Uh -huh. Alright, and then here, short look onto the USB port, the charging port, in case you have to replace that. That should be really easy to remove. There's just two screws, you take that off and then you can replace or fix your uh, charging port and then here you have the the vent tube here that goes out here to the back that comes all the way from the front and goes then to the back okay then okay look uh, let's look look take a look at the right side there's actually another screw here that i missed by the on off button it's a really tiny screw this has to be removed too and then we open this part up and Okay, so there's a whole lot more going on in here. 
Okay, so there's also this black goop that keeps stuff in place. Alright, so what do we have here? Looks like here on the bottom there where the goop is, that's where the charging, the battery charging electronics are here and then a couple of wires going up here to the front to all the the other buttons here the uh, on-off button, the bluetooth button and it seems like that's where the majority of the electronics are located at and then here in the middle of course the two speakers and then let's have a look at the batteries here what do we have? we have two batteries looks like these are LiPo batteries and what what are they like 400 milliamps okay and then let's have a quick look here there's a label with some more detail so if you want to if you want to look at that a little further then maybe just rewind and uh, pause the video at that point let's see here let's get try to get a little bit better close up here for you in case you want to read that Okay, so and that's that's already it. This is the whole JBL sound gear. So let's see if I can uh, get this back together without a problem. <coughs> and it actually is possible to reassemble this without even being able to notice that this was ever taken apart again. So this is really easy. Alright, and then let's see if this thing still works. I'm going to turn this back on and then play a little tune here. And so uh, if you have any questions and uh, or comments, then leave a note down in the comment section below. And uh, please like and subscribe. And uh, also check out my other JBL videos.